Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Riven. When we last left off, we pretty much saw the, the you know, the, the Resistance Age and whatnot. And uh, we actually uh, retrieved our Prison Age book as well as something new. I'm gonna get out of here where there is no music, so I can actually see what this new book is. Alright. Oh. And for the record, I have also took the liberty of making another one of my nifty little emergency save files in case something goes wrong. Uh, this, these couple parts might be short. I'm actually on a bit of a time crunch to get things done. So, anyway, what did we just recently pick up? Oh, son of a bitch. I think this is Catherine's journal. <laughs> Hope you guys like reading, because we're doing another <laughs> reading part. Fuck. <sighs> I linked to Riven a week ago. The smell of the place overwhelmed me moments before I could see anything. Jesus Christ. What's with Catherine, Gin, and even Atreus? Like, ugh. Actually, no, I think her handwriting's worse than Gin's. With my spirit only cleared, I stood motionless, peering ahead through the dim. There was a moment. <sighs> I write quickly from my prison. Your book within reach, increasing your thrive. After questioning her, I've concluded it was written by Atreus for a very specific purpose. Again, well, despite where it, although he may have suspicions, if you can find my prison, you will still need the combination to rescue me. Gin keeps it in his office. Then, I assume, we're to sign Atreus. I think I know how it might be done, but don't signal him before I'm released. So, she pretty much left us a personal note. Okay. I love reading these things, I really do, but not this time, guys. I mean, oh, Christ, I can try. Um, I'm trying to remember it all, but it is difficult, maybe because of the... There was a voice, a man I did not sit before me, Rivenair, though his voice was... I apologize, guys. When I get to Mist 3, I will continue to read these journals through the rest of the series. Just as of now, with how buggy Riven's been, I just... I can't stand it anymore. I, I honestly can't. So... With some of you guys probably questioning and wondering why I'm not going to read the journal. Because that, that is the... I think Gin has one more journal. And if he does, I will do my best to read it. But the thing is, pretty much all that is doing is Catherine is pretty much talking about how she inspired the Rivenese to basically revolt. Like, get some of them to revolt with her against Gin. And that's pretty much what it is. It's just, you know, her letting the Rivenese know that help is on the way, and she pretty much wrote that age we went to to basically be a shelter for the uh, for the Rivenese. So, if this age were to collapse, at least they would be safe. Boy, don't we know a lot about collapsing ages. So, here's what we're going to do. We're actually going to activate those fire marble domes that we have seen scattered across Riven. Um, give me a couple seconds while I look something up real quick. Fire, marble, solution. I know I'm cheating, guys, but this is the hardest puzzle.
cool. I got it loaded up. So, how do we access this so and this so-called difficult, impossible puzzle in the game? Well, as you saw, we basically raised the drawbridge. And now we've got to do this stuff again. Now actually game get back to the main entrance of the place, and then we shall do it. But yeah, pretty much what this puzzle is is that everything that we've seen, we pretty much had to deduce um, by looking at the maps and features what island uh, represents each. And once you found that out, and then figured out the corresponding color for each of the fire marble domes, then you pretty much come back here, and then we then have to basically go up to... Okay, you know what? Screw it. Basically, I had to come back here. Awesome. Then we had to come up to the top of the giant fire marble, and then we had to input the pieces in. It's hard to tell what it is, but you can pretty much kind of faintly make out what the islands are. So here's one right here, there's one right here, one, two, three, four, five. Then what we had to do is we basically take the hints we've gotten throughout our, our journey and figure out where each everything is. And then we basically need to take the corresponding marbles. And if you notice, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. One of these colors does not belong. We pretty much had to deduce what each of the colors are. So we're going to start with blue because it's the easiest for me to look at, and it goes right there. This is Island 5. Island 5 is Catherine's Prison Age. Okay? We'll then take uh, orange. And it goes right here. And if I remember correctly, I believe that... I think this is Map Island. I think this is this is Island One, I believe. This is Island I don't know. Actually, no. This is Island Three, Crater Island, and then uh, this is Island One, and then this is Island Four, and this is Island Two. You know, because game freeze or not, don't ever do that to me again. Game green one goes there. What's in? Then we take the purple one. It goes right there. And we take the red one. And the red one. And now we solve the puzzle. Thing is, we don't know if we did it or not until we hit this button. And, uh, if we did it correctly, which I think we did, then all that we need to do now is <laughs> go find a fire marble. <laughs> which means we now need to do a lot all this crap again. If we did this correctly, we should be able to access Gen's age. Now that we stopped it correctly, I have to input the new combination. Because, yeah, I had to do that. Because after all, I had to go back to Island 3 for God knows the number of time. And the new combination is 23. 
This one sucks and can't really see the numbers right. 21. 15. And... 7. Yep, we can access the book now, hopefully. No, we can't. Oh, shit. Hmm. Well, that dome is pretty much closed, so we don't need to worry about how to... ...reactivate it. Now it just means I fucked up the puzzle sucks because, like I said, this is one of the worst puzzles in the game. But luckily enough, we can just do this number. Okay, I actually forgot to activate the device. <laughs> I you're supposed to hit the white button. If you heard that giant ass like release of pressure and steam, that means we did the puzzle right. So I'm clicking like mad here. Oh. It had to do this, didn't it? Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. I guess, is that one save data now corrupted like everything else I've done? Because if it is... Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, uh... Shit. Well... I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh... Make this its own really short part. So... Yeah. Next time, guys, on Let's Play Riven, um... I'm gonna go and redo the puzzle and everything else, and then we'll pretty much be we when we return. I will have the pretty much the linking book to Gin's age all set up and open. So what to do is click on it, and we can go to the next age. Um, and then once we're done with Gin's age, we're pretty much done with the game. So hopefully not too long now, folks. And as soon as we're done with this, I. As soon as we're done with Riven, I'm going to go back to doing some emulation stuff until I can uh, find my copy of Miss 3. And then once I get Exile, we'll continue on there. So until next time, guys, see you then.